Hi, I'm Dr. Kartika Mohan, Consultant Fetal Medicine at Hint Labs Medical College, Trivandrum, which is a unit of HLL Life Care. I want to talk to you about fetal medicine today. Now, what is fetal medicine? We deal with a fetus. Fetus is not just a mass of cells. It is going to be your baby in a few weeks time. The fetus grows up to be a baby. So it is important that you know what happens to the fetus inside the uterus. You don't want to wait till the baby comes out to find out if there is anything wrong with the baby. Nowadays, the technology is so advanced that you can actually figure out problems in the fetus from the time they are about three months old. At three months of pregnancy, your fetus is just about five or six centimeters. Maybe as big as your finger. But still, we can find out if there is anything wrong with the baby in its structure. Like we can look at its hands, the feet, the heart. In fact, the heart is as big as a lemon seed. But we can still evaluate the fetal heart at three months of pregnancy. We can also look for a lot of chromosomal abnormalities right at the third month. So it is important that you get your third month pregnancy scan done. That is as early as we can figure out problems in the baby, in the fetus. Now this baby is going to grow up to a 2 or 3 or a 4 kg baby and it's going to come out into your hands and this baby is going to become the future generation of our country, of our world. So we have to catch them very early. So that is our target. I'm sure that when you're pregnant, your gynecologist will be taking very good care of you as a mother. But are they looking at the fetus? Yes, they do a bit. But we focus on looking at the fetus. We, we treat them as our own patient. It doesn't matter whether they are inside the mother's womb. The baby is, the, the fetus is our patient. When you get pregnant, what are the important things that you should know about? I'm sure that your gynecologist will tell you all about it in detail and they will guide you about what to do. But I will tell you about what are the scans that you need to do in pregnancy. So the first and the first scan is usually the early pregnancy scan, which we do to find out if the fetus is actually being formed inside the uterus. And that confirms your dates and makes it, it, it tells you when you will deliver your baby. The next scan is the most important scan as far as I am concerned from the fetal point of view because the NT scan at third month is when you find out a huge chunk of your problems in the fetus and we can also screen for chromosomal problems like the Down syndrome. Now, Down syndrome was a scared thing a few years back because many times the Down syndrome babies are normal. We can't just pick them up on a scan. So, we will do a blood test in your third month, which is called as a double marker. And this double marker will tell you whether your fetus is at risk of having Down syndrome. Now, if you are at high risk, we have a lot of options. We can do an amniocentesis or a chorionic villus sampling, which is basically testing the fetus directly. We do not do a scan, we do not do a blood test, but instead, just putting in a small needle into your uterus and we are testing the baby, baby's own, own cells. In case we have an abnormality in the amniocentesis, that is if we diagnose the baby with a chromosomal abnormality, unfortunately we do not have an option to treat it. But because it is very early, we do have an option of terminating the pregnancy if you do not want to continue the pregnancy with a chromosomally abnormal child. Now, in case you have missed your NT scan or the double marker screening, we do have other options. You can go ahead and do a quadruple screening test, which can be done during the fourth month of pregnancy, and that can be followed up with an anomaly scan, which is considered as the most important scan in pregnancy. Now, that's done at the fifth month, and that is the scan which can pick up more than 95% of the problems in the fetus. We look at the fetus in detail. We look at all the organs, the hands, the legs, the heart, the kidneys, the spine, the head, the brain. 
So almost all the organs are developed by then. And with this scan, we can pretty much be sure that your baby, your fetus is doing fine. After this, around the 7th or the 8th month, you can follow it up with a growth scan. It will tell you if your baby is growing well and it will tell you your baby's weight. The technology we use in fetal medicine is very different. It's very advanced. We have very high-end machines and very high-end technologies for testing your fetus. So the advantage of Hint Labs is that we offer all these technologies to you at a very low cost. We have subsidized rates for procedures like amniocentesis and chorionic pillar sampling. I hope this video was very useful to you and it will help you in planning your pregnancy and managing your pregnancy. Thank you.